Hi everyone, our lesson for today is in energy transformations. We will describe how different form of energy changes and identify the transformation of energy that takes place around us. To start, take a look at the video. What does flowing water have to do with electricity? You may already know that the mechanical energy of moving water can be transformed into electrical energy. Most forms of energy can be transformed into other forms. A change from one form of energy to another is called an energy transformation. When energy changes in this way, the energy is in queues up or lost. Same amount of energy exists after the transformation. There are two types of transformation. First is single transformation. Sometimes one form of energy needs to be transformed into another to get the work done. For example, a cell phone transforms electrical energy to electromagnetic energy that travels to other phones. Another example, your body transforms the chemical energy in your food to mechanical energy. You need to move your muscles. Second is multiple transformation. Often, a series of energy transformation is needed to do the work. Example, the mechanical energy used to strike the match is transformed first to thermal energy and thermal energy causes the particles in the match to release chemical energy which is transformed to thermal energy and electromagnetic energy. Another example is the energy transformation that takes place in a popcorn machine. The popcorn machine changes electrical to thermal energy which heats the popcorn. The heat causes the popcorn to pop. You can see that the popping corn has mechanical energy. It overflows the pad and falls into the pile of popcorn at the bottom of the machine. The popping corn also has energy. That's why it makes popping sound. To summarize, energy transformation is a change from one form of energy to another. Energy is always conserved in energy transformation. That's all for today. See you again next time for new learnings. Have a great day.